Hello everyone, Craig Chamberlain again with the Answer Byte segment where I answer your questions in as small amount of time as I possibly can. Today's Answer Byte question comes from JXSHS Toots on YouTube. Make sure you post your questions below as well. This question is, what's the best motherboard I can get for around $125? Well, right now the best socket out there is the LGA 1155. You're gonna get the most bang for your buck out of Intel, in my opinion. Of course, there's always places for the AMD right now, especially in workstation and business environments, but the best bang for your buck you're gonna get out of an Intel board. So that immediately puts me in the Intel category and my favorite board right now is $124.99, $125 just like you asked. It's the ASUS P8Z77-V. I'm going to put a link to it in the video description below. The reason I love this board has a built-in HDMI output so you can do your onboard video out. You've got your serial ATA 6.0, 6 gigabit per second uh, slots of course so that's pretty much standard on most boards now you will have your USB 3.0 it is a ATX form factor which means it works with just about any chassis you can buy on the market and as I said it is Intel also it still has your PCI Express slots it has two separate PCI Express slots if you want to do Crossfire or SLI personally I'm not a big fan of those I don't think you really get the value per dollar or the performance per dollar out of them but one of the best part about ASUS, ASUS boards is this easy BIOS that they come packaged with that allows you to easily go in and overclock your system and tweak it and modify it. It also allows for easy configuration when you're setting up your system for the first time. All those things combined, and then you combine it with the reviews. Reviews are pretty spectacular on it. Four and a half out of five stars right now on Amazon, um, and that's about 54 people who have reviewed it. If I look on Newegg, it's pretty much just as good. Four to four and a half eggs out of five. So all of that put together for the price, you're going to get a really solid board. Again, that's the P8Z77-V my personal favorite on the market right now. Now, if you have no interest in Intel, you're looking just say, hey, I wanna go shop around, I'm gonna post the link in the video description below of 100 top, the 100 top motherboards on amazon.com. Feel free to go there and check them out, and hey, it's the top 100, so they're all gonna be really, really good, and you may find something that works just for you. Now, if you have any questions, make sure you post them in the comments below. If you have any experience, post it in the comments below. If you wanna keep watching these videos, make sure you subscribe, wherever the subscribe button is, and I will see you guys in the next Answer Byte video. Thanks again for stopping by.